Hello, my name is LaToya Wyatt, and I will be presenting Shoki the Demon Cueler by Utagawa Kunisada. Shoki the Demon Cueler was created by Utagawa Kunisada. It is a woodblock print, 14 and a half by nine and a half, created between 1849 and 1853. Shoki is a Japanese legend that was believed to ward off demons. Created during the Edo period of Japan, he was considered to be a deity to many during this time. As mentioned, Shoki was created during the Edo period. So let's talk about it. The Edo period, or the Tokugawa period, is the period between 1603 and 1868 in the history of Japan. This period is when the Japanese society was under the rule of the Tokugawa Shoanite and the country's 300 regional daima. During this time, Japan's primary religion was Confucianism. This practice was a religion that is based on philosophical beliefs. It stressed the importance of loyalty and obedience to hierarchy. It also emphasized personal and governmental morality. During this time, many didn't view Confucianism as a religion, but as a way of life. This practice deeply influenced the livelihood of many Japanese, Chinese, and Vietnamese people during the Edo period. The Edo period had a great impact on the artistry of Utagawa Kunisada. While being ruled by Tokugawa, many of the citizens enjoyed arts and culture. During this period, the society was experiencing economic growth, strict social order, and isolated foreign policies, all of which had a great impact on their culture, government, and society. The Tokugawa dynasty lasted over 250 years before the restoration followed. The central idea of the Tokugawa rule was to reestablish order in global and societal affairs. There were only four social classes that were acknowledged, the samurai warriors, farmers, artisans, and merchants. Shoki the demon cooler is considered a deity in Japan, but on the feudal system, he would be considered a samurai warrior. Though the Tokugawa dynasty ruled for many years, their downfall came crashing to an end during the Boshin War. This war was against a 16-year-old emperor by the name of Mihai. He combined two different clans, the Satsuma and the Chokushu, just to defeat the long-ruling almighty Tokugawa dynasty. After Emperor Mihai's victory in 1868, he would soon change the name from Edo Japan to Tokyo Japan. He ruled Tokyo from 1868 until his death. He ruled during a time of rapid change. He switched the nation into a capitalist country and headed the Japanese Industrial Revolution. Yuchigawa Kunisada was born in Tokyo, Japan in 1786. He grew up in the Eastern Edo district known as Hanju. Though his father died one year after he was born, Kunisada's parents owned their own ferry boat business. The revenue generated from this business allowed their family to have the financial security that most families did not afford to have. Because his family was financially stable, he spent most of his childhood painting and creating sketch art in which he excelled. His talent was recognized by Tokukuni, 
the master of the Yukidekawa school. His style was called Yukioi. He was typically known for erotic portraits of women and actors. Kunisada was considered one of the best painters and printmakers of his time. Tokuni was Kunisada's master woodblock instructor. He was also the head of the Yutagawa school. He moved into great fame during his time as a master instructor. In viewing the artwork, you will notice that Shoki has on black boots with a long robe trimmed in black with a bow and sash. He has a wild black beard that accompanies his wild hair. He has large eyes with a wide nose and tight lips. In his right hand, he holds a red and gray demon that also has wild hair. The demon is looking ahead and appears to be hiding. In his left hand, he has a sword trimmed in blue. He is leaned forward with his left foot pointed. The creation of Shoki the Demon Cooler is revered as one of Utagawa's most noted woodblock prints. Shoki contains many different line qualities, such as thick strokes. This technique is located throughout his robe. The thickness of a line can often symbolize the characteristic of strength within artwork. Let's talk about the construction of the artwork. The artwork is 2D. It is achromatic in color. It has predominantly curved lines. The lines are geometric within Shoki's garments. The gesture is very quick and has rapid strokes within the arms of the man. Space is positive and negative for both the man and the demon. The value has shading on the face, cheeks, garments, muscles of the arms, and the bottom half of the demon. The demon is also achromatic and has a warm color palette. Shoki is one of the most powerful characters depicted in Japanese culture and history. Also known as Zhongku in China, he is considered by common people as an icon for protection against illness and poverty. Legends about Shoki first appear in Tanjira Chinese documents. He is also held as a deity within the Taoist pantheon religion. The difference between Taoism and Confucianism is that Taoism focuses on living harmoniously, while Confucianism focuses on five key relationships, ruler and subject, wife and husband, older and younger, siblings, friend and friend, and father and son. Shoki the Demon Cooler has held a great impact on Japanese culture. Revered as a deity and legend for many, this artwork has traveled through the Edo period to modern world history. Some still today adorn their homes with figures of Shoki to protect against evil spirits. It's truly a work of art that has been passed down through time.